Hey, what's up everyone? It's your boy Fax, and what did I say? <laughs> Aren't Quavo and Saweetie supposed to be goals? Weren't they like relationship goals? Weren't, 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 weren't people looking up to Quavo and Saweetie? Weren't they your ideal couple, the magical couple? Now look, I don't know who was looking at this video. We gotta stop with celebrity relationship goals. Stop looking to other people as your role models or people you strive for because most of the time it's fake it's for entertainment i'll tell you right now money bag yo and ari that's a fake relationship that's just to be goals and to brighten or heighten their uh career elevators or whatever the case is same thing with quavo and saweetie right now i'm not saying that the relationship wasn't genuine but Listen, you know Saweetie more so for her relationship with Quavo than any music that she made. In fact, I'll dare anybody watching this video right now, name me five Saweetie records. Five, off the top of your head. Five Saweetie records. And then I dare you to name me your favorite one. I guarantee you, you cannot come up with it. Even if someone paid you, you cannot come up with it. Listen. Stop her. Saweetie was capping the hardest. She was capping like she was so happy in her relationship with Quavo when apparently that was not the case at all. This is giving me Jay-Z Beyonce vibes because remember that that video that came back a while ago with Jay-Z getting into it with Solange in that elevator. These elevators are going to expose people, right? Saweetie and Quavo were goals and this and that, but now you see behind the scenes what was really going on. Listen, these people aren't genuinely happy. Quavo could trick on Saweetie all he wants, buy her cars, all the Birkin bags she wants, and she wasn't happy. She was dealing with a whole bunch of nonsense on the side, and she wasn't talking about it. But being showered with gifts and promoting that to her followers, to the youth and other people that look up to them as goals, for what? Why do you have to pretend to be happy when you're not genuinely happy? It makes no sense at all so again let's stop with the celebrity couple celebrity couple relationship goals let's stop with these youtube channels that are over a relationship channel where they play fake pranks on each other and this and that man listen it's not worth it at the end of the day none of it is worth it quavo uh, listen <laughs> he he's taking a page off of offset's book offset's gonna do whatever it is he wants to do uh uh what's it called cardi b's gonna find out and cardi b is gonna pretend to leave him she's not gonna leave him he's gonna shower her with another car or maybe another birkin bag and she's gonna pretend to be happy i i just don't get it <laughs> allegedly this is because of quavo uh being not faithful to saweetie but he's a rapper what what, what do you expect <laughs> If normal dudes aren't even being faithful to their girls, you think a rapper as such as Quavo who could get anybody he wants is going to be faithful to a Saweetie? You know, let's just stop the cap. Let's just stop the cap. Um, I don't advocate for domestic violence towards anybody, but if you're not happy, why pretend to be happy? Why put up a front? You know how many interviews and whatever the case is that Quavo and Saweetie have gone on pretending to be some sort of happy couple when they were not a happy couple I'm Quavo I'm asking Jay-Z for advice after Jay-Z had that elevator situation go down if I'm Quavo I'm asking Jay-Z for advice but anyway do you guys agree with me disagree with me let me know in the comments down below don't forget to subscribe it's your boy Fax I'm out